Governors in Wayne County, West Virginia will decide on Election Day whether to support a $2.5 million bond referendum. That money would pay for the county's three high school grass football fields to be replaced with turf. Andrew Colgrove has the story. Well, it's that time of year when a lot of grass football fields are not in the best of condition. A lot of mud it makes it hard for those young athletes to get good footing. That's why some voters say they're planning to vote yes for a $2.5 million bond referendum that would put in turf at the football fields at Spring Valley, Wayne, and Tulsa. The levy would cost the average property owner about $10 a year. We play high school games, we play JV games, we play middle school games, we play middle school JV games, and then we got two youth leagues that use our field. And you know, it, to us, it will be a godsend just to get the turf. School officials have said turf would also be beneficial for community events and band competitions. I think we need it. I do understand people's concern about the taxes because of loss of jobs, but we have all the teams play on this one field. It does take a lot of damage and then it's not in proper shape for playoffs. But other voters believe that's a lot of money to throw at having nicer football fields when there are still so many needs in the classroom. If this passes, school officials say it would be paid off in 10 years, and they say the turf would be in place by the beginning of next football season. Back to you. Voters in Wayne County rejected a bond levy four years ago that would have paid for turf fields, but that levy was quite a bit different. That one also would have paid for a couple new schools. Continue